Good morning, plus siders. What's up, and welcome to the vlog. It is a Tuesday. No, it's not. It's Wednesday. Yeah, it's Wednesday. Good morning, Sue. Good morning. How are you? Good. Hi, Lulu. Good morning, Lulu. Oh, my phone's not a pillow. How are you doing today, Lulu? She's doing good, in case you guys are wondering. Mm hmm. Playing with your baby doll stuff there? <laughs> Anyway, uh, my mother-in-law is coming over today to take Sophia to the pool. So that's pretty fun, huh? Yeah. So while they're gone, I'm going to get a couple things done. I'm going to edit a, a, a video. I edited yesterday's vlog last night, but I have an extra video yesterday that we recorded, a baby doll video. So I'll get that done and finished. And uh, I also want to clean out my desk a little bit. It's getting a little bit messy or cluttered, really. Um, so I want to straighten that out a little bit probably take that happy birthday sign down since uh, it's not birthday season anymore and oh we're making a cool dinner wait I forget what it's called it's some kind of a casserole I'll show you well I'm not gonna show you till later but this is what I'm making it's called creamy chicken quinoa and broccoli casserole so as you can imagine the main ingredients are chicken quinoa and broccoli and it's a casserole so uh Pretty excited about it. It seems like it's kind of a lot-ish. But I don't know, maybe it's not so bad. Cause you gotta make a sauce first, then you put it together, then you get the broccoli ready, and then you bake it. I don't know, maybe it's not so bad. It seems like there's a lot of steps, but maybe it's not so bad, like I said. But anyway, join us and let's have some fun. Okay, so I ordered gallium on the internet. I'm gonna show you guys one thing so far. Um, so I have it outside in the sun, trying to melt it, and it's partially melted in the sun but all we need is a drop today. So gallium does something, actually we're gonna do this outside. Gallium does something to aluminum. I'm no scientist, I saw the word, I don't know what it means. Basically, it basically kills aluminum. Maybe it deconstructs aluminum and uh, you'll see what it does. So I'm gonna take a soda can, well, an iced tea can, and uh, I'm going to put a drop right over here, just a little drop. I did scratch the surface a little bit here just to speed up the process. Gallium will eat through the coating on aluminum, but just to speed up the process, scratched it a little bit with the key. Let's get this started. Okay, it is super hot out here. I'm not sure if the uh, gallium has to stay in the liquid form for it to work, but it has to sit on here for about a half an hour for it to work. So just to be sure, I'm going to leave this can out here in the sun so it doesn't harden, just in case. I'm no scientist, like I said. It's just a cool thing I want to show you guys. All right, so I'm going to open this up. It's not completely melted, but all I need is a tiny little drop. So I have a little thing here, a little dropper. And that's probably plenty right here. So all I'm going to do is drop it right on there. Okay, so as you can see, the little drop is on the can. Like I said, I'm going to leave it here in the sun for half an hour, and I will bring you guys back and show you what happens. In the meantime, I am going to pack Sophia's lunch because they're going to have lunch by the pool, like they usually do. So uh, I'm going to pack her a sandwich, some fruit, and a little snack. I just peeked out the door. It's only 15 minutes. Kind of looks like something's going on. Let's see what this is. Let's see what's going on here. Ooh. It's doing something. You can see there is the dot, and then something's going on there. It's rippling. Ooh, baby. We'll leave that for now. All right, you all ready for the pool? Yeah. So bathing suit, cover up, you can wear your Crocs, packing a bag for them also. They like to bring the boogie board, a water shooter, she's got her little vest, some water, extra water bottles, towel. Uh, I forget what else, whatever. It's all set to go, just waiting for her grandmommy to come. Have a lot of fun, okay? okay. She's got her sunscreen on. And you're bringing Cookie, right? She's gonna go swim in? Awesome. She, she didn't mean to angel when, she, when angels said. Are you serious? She was mean to her? Did she apologize? No. She has to apologize. She, if she wants to go to the pool, she has to apologize. Because she, she, she was about to jump over here, Angel was right on that pillow, and she, and she actually fell on Angel. Well, if she wants to go to the pool, she has to apologize, or else she can't go. You can't. You can't be mean. Cookie. Sorry, Angel. For 
are jumping over the cows and hurting you. It's okay, just don't do it again, okay? Okay, I promise. Okay, so she can go to the pool now? Yeah. All right. I love going to the pool when you Okay, so Sophia is down at the pool and uh, I'm gonna go before I have lunch and get some work done. I'm gonna go out here and do this soda can thing. It's been over a half hour. It's probably been like an hour at this point. So I figured longer is a little bit better. Let's see what we got here. So the gallium I have in here is now completely melted. It's so cool, I love it. I love this stuff. So it's non-toxic, but you do have to be careful because of what it does to aluminum. Like if I got a little bit on the back of my phone and I didn't know it and left it for a little bit, the same thing would happen to my phone, you know what I mean? So you do have to be careful with this stuff, um, but it's nice that it's non-toxic. So here we go. We got the soda can. How do I do this? How do I show you guys? Let's go down a little bit. Okay, so there is the soda can, there is the drop. Let's see what happens if I push here. Whoa, whoa. Look at that. It just lifts right up and just like kind of disintegrates. Look at that. It's not how aluminum should behave, right? Look at that. Look how cool that is. Whoa, it almost, it turns it into like foil. You hear that? turns it into foil. Oh my goodness. That is so cool how it's so weak. Okay, could okay, this part's not too weak. I'm sure if I put more on there it would, you know, do more damage. But uh look at that. That is crazy how it just kind of disintegrates. So I just wanted to show you guys that. I thought that was pretty cool. Um look at that. Look at that. It's oh sorry I'm not even showing you. It's soft. It's soft. <laughs> that is so cool. But yeah, like I said, I thought that was cool. I just wanted to show you guys that. Um, I would assume if I put it anywhere on the can, it would do that, even the bottom. I don't know, I guess. So if you have any experiments you guys would like to see, other aluminum things I'm trying to think of that's a little bit more hefty, I could leave it on overnight and it does even more damage, I'd like to see. I don't know. If you guys have any ideas of what I could put this stuff on and see it destroy, let me know in the comments down below. Um, we'll make fidget spinners another day with this and uh, I want to go inside to get some lunch. Excuse the microwave is going. I'm having some uh, Alfredo pasta with chicken and broccoli, lean cuisine. But like look at this. I'll show you even more. Let me focus. Like look at that. It's weak. Even the rim, about, rim around it is weak. And you know that's a strong rim right there. Look at that. Just able to just... It's still a little tough but it's so interesting. Look at that. It's just coming apart. Just coming apart. Like imagine I left this, imagine I put more on it and left it for longer. It would do way more damage than this. But that is still so cool to see. Welcome back little girl. So how was your pool experience? Good. You swim around? Yeah. I heard you put your face under the water, is that true? Yeah. Oh my goodness. That's so cool. Did you hold your breath? And then do it? Or was it an accident? I hold it my breath. Awesome. Wait, don't pop it. Oh, Bob, it look, it's getting slower. Wait, I know who's going to win. I know who's going to win. Oh, yeah, the white one is still stronger than the red one. Wait, wait a second. Wait, white wait. balloon. Tell them about cool it. You just red wait, let's do it. I gotta hold it at the same time to do it right. Let's do a balloon race. Ready, set, go. Oh, white blows it out of the water. The white wins. This one. Whoa, whoa, whoa. This one? Spit it out, girl. This one? <laughs> whoa, whoa, be. This one will be dead tomorrow. Probably. It'll be like on the floor or like floating in the middle. Anyway, let's go take a bath, okay? Probably. Gotta get that pool and sunscreen off of you. And then I'll probably start making some dinner. Mm, I'm excited about that dinner actually. It sounds so good. Like a creamy chicken, quinoa, and broccoli. Oh, geez. It sounds good. It really does. So, what are you doing? I'm making uh, grape juice for a snack and Lily for her dinner. Oh, okay. And I'm starting myself over here getting some dinner. I just cubed up the chicken. 
Um, yeah, I think I'm gonna start. It's four o'clock. So I think it's a good time to start this because this takes probably close to an hour to cook, I think. Yeah, 30 minutes in the oven here, preparation, another 10 to 15, another five, yeah, about an hour, maybe more. I'm super excited. Lulu's even her, eat, eating her dinner. And uh, yeah, it's just been a day at home for me at least. I mean, Sophia went to the pool, but I got some stuff done. I cleared out my desk and even like the dresser and like there's some stuff I needed to like neaten up in the bedroom area. I got all that done. I went through all the like stuff for the vlogs. Like I have like a box for all the stuff for the vlogs. That's where I have like where I keep the gallium and like I bought magnetic fluid. Don't forget about that. I still have that to do in the vlogs. Um, some toys and stuff. I have like a little section for all that stuff so kind of neaten that up a little bit cleaned out the Keurig a little bit because that I'm getting a lot of coffee grind in my coffee and tea so I had to like cycle the water through a lot and uh, it seems pretty nice and clear now so uh, thumbs up for that but like I said I'm gonna cook some dinner all right so here is some chicken broth and milk once that boils I'm gonna mix in a little bit more milk poultry seasoning and a little bit of flour. It's gonna be like the sauce. All right, I whisked this, now it's like this thick stuff. I'm gonna mix into this and it should create a sauce. Like I said, hi Soph, I smell it? it? Smells like chicken. Ew. Chicken seasoning, poultry seasoning. Okay, so this is the sauce. I think it'll thicken a little bit in time, but I need to move on to step number two, assembly. Okay, so do you wanna tell them what we just put in this bowl? Yeah, we put bacon and quinoa and, and just a little bit of sauce from here. We yeah, have the sauce that we made, the water, and like she said, quinoa and turkey bacon that I just cooked in the microwave. And that's the sauce. That's the base. In kindergarten, could I have turkey bacon for lunch? Sure. I think you could make me make like, hmm, we could make I, like a sandwich or something. I just... It was good, right? I know, I wish it was more that I could pick at, but we put it in here. Too bad. We'll have it for dinner, because it's in here. Okay, so now I put the chicken, I put that whole mixture that I just showed you in there, and then I put the cube chicken all on top. Now I'm just gonna sprinkle it with a little bit of mist dash, and then I'm gonna bake this for 30 minutes. Can I um, that? Yeah, you can help me. Um, what else do I have to say? Yeah, this looks very liquidy. I've never made a casserole before, so I have no idea, but I'm just following the recipe. Yeah, go ahead, sprinkle it on, girl. Yeah, baby. Get it like all over too. Yeah. That's probably good, that's probably good. Awesome job, Soph. I thought I was gonna have to step in, but I'm just gonna leave it, cause you did good. All right, I'm gonna pop this in the oven now. So while that's in the oven, I'm going to boil some broccoli. I'm gonna cut off some of the, uh, like I'm just gonna leave the florets and then I'm gonna sprinkle it on. I'll show you when I do it. but. Sophia informed me that her babies need an ice pack, so here you go. Thank you. What's wrong with, what do they need an ice pack for? She, she has a cold and... Oh, a headache? Yeah. <laughs> okay. So I thought this dinner was gonna be like a lot of work, but honestly, it's really not. It's pretty easy. So what, I have the thing in the oven still, so that's cooking, and this is gonna be done. I'm gonna cut this up a little bit, and I'm basically gonna check the consistency. If it's still a little watery, I'm gonna cook it for another 10 to 15 minutes, and then I'm gonna take it out, put the broccoli on top, put some cheese on there, and bake it for another five last minutes, and then we're gonna eat it. And I don't think it's gonna be bad because everything that's in there is delicious to me at least. I don't know about Sophia with the broccoli, but uh, I can't imagine this being disgusting. You know what I mean? Because everything in there is so good. But uh, anyway, um, I like when there's like time in between a recipe before it ends. Because then look, look, I cleaned up. There, I still need that. But like I washed all the dishes, I dried it, I put it away. That's awesome, I love when that happens. So that when dinner is ready, the only thing that's dirty after dinner are the dishes that you use to eat and the pan that it's in. I like that. Okay, fresh out of the oven, this is what it looks like. I think because of the liquidiness, I think I am gonna bake it for another 10 to 15 minutes like it says. So I'm gonna do that now before I put the broccoli on. I cut up the broccoli. It smells good and it looks good too. But yeah, I think like 10 to 15 more minutes should be good. Sophia's checking out the American Girl magazine. <laughs> Bitty Babies, American Girls. Oh, there's the Bitty Baby section. 
Oh my goodness, she's already planning our next New York City trip. Right, so <laughs> she's circling things aggressively, I might add. <laughs> Look how aggressively she circled swaddler blankets. Oh my goodness graciousness. Hey Lolo, I put a little blanket out for Lolo. Keeps the hair off the couch, really. That's mainly mainly the reason. How you doing, Lolo? You miss Brady? Probably not, but... Whoa! What? Okay. Yeah. Excuse the noise. The microwave fan is on. It goes on automatically, and I can't turn it off until it wants to turn off. It's usually not too long, but today, it is, for some reason. This fan is still going, but that's the dinner. I think it looks really good. I'm excited to eat this. Ooh, look at that. Bacon, broccoli, cheese, chicken, quinoa. I can't. It's annoying, right? All right, dinner is served. It looks like... I, th I don't think I can not like this. I like everything in it, you yeah. know? Yeah. But it kind of looks like vomit. Vomit? Well, probably a delicious vomit. Yeah, I guess. Oh, babies are eating too. Grape juice for dinner. Yeah, yeah. They're she sharing a grape juice. She's not sharing. Oh, they're not sharing, okay. She, she doesn't like swallow. She oh, okay. She does, though. Alright. Okay, so a review on the dinner. It was good. Was it the best thing? No. Kind of flavorless, like you needed to put salt on it. Um, and as Liz said, it kind of feels like it's a side. More of a side, not like a like the dinner, like the actual main course. It would have been good if we had something, and then that's like on the side. So will we make it again? Honestly, probably not. But if we did, we would make it as a side to something else, I think. I don't know. But anyway, I'm gonna end this vlog here. I'm gonna sit down and uh, get these clips on over to my computer here, right here and uh, charge this battery so that tomorrow we're all ready to uh, Start vlogging again. So hopefully you guys enjoyed this video. If you did, like and subscribe. Hit that thumbs up button. You know, I got to kind of changing what I'm saying at the end here. And that doesn't make sense. If you enjoyed the video, give it a thumbs up. Like and subscribe. That's, liking is a thumbs up. So it's like, what can I say? What can I say? I like to, I don't know. I always evolve my intros, my outros. So I feel like it needs to change a little bit. So. Hopefully you guys enjoy this video. If you did, don't forget to like and subscribe. Thanks for watching, and as always, I will see you tomorrow. That worked. Have a great night, guys, and peace.